got a phone call from one of his other workmates saying he had been in an accident. That his bobcat went through the ice. No. And I didn't know at that time he was deceased and I phoned our very full close friend and we sped out to PA and our CMP told me I had to leave the site and nobody would tell me what was going on. And then actually coroner, who I didn't know at the time she was a coroner, was talking to me and told me she'd call me when he's out of the water. So 11.30 that night, after eight and a half hours of waiting, I found out he was dead. I couldn't comprehend it. I still can't comprehend that he's gone. Well, I wanted to find other people that were in the similar circumstances. The widow that I met out here, she walked with me almost every day because walking, getting the sunlight and talking just made me feel a bit more normal because you really feel abnormal for the longest time like you don't fit in anywhere and if he would have met his dad if he'd been, been raised by his dad he would have had an awesome daddy and a happy mom now he has a slightly mediocre widowed mom and, <laughs> and no dad